Hi, I'm Hendrik and welcome to How Does It Taste? Today I'm going to test this Balkan risotto from Track and Eat. Let's get started. The Track and Eat brand is part of the Swiss Katadun group and the Track and Eat meals are around since the mid 2000s. The Swiss Katadin company was established in 1928 and is thus soon 90 years old. I have eaten various track and eat meals over the past 10 years and I'm looking forward to try this Balkan risotto from them. Track and eat offers 26 different meals and they really do some very exotic meals like a borscht stew, a Mexican style quinoa and a gourmet game stew. The meals cost between 6.5 and 8.5 euros per pouch. All track and eat meals are made without preservatives, colorants and flavor enhancing additives. The Balkan risotto weighs 190 grams in the pouch and has 605 calories. It costs 7.5 euros and ingredients include rice, beef, peppers, tomatoes and onions. The packaging is okay. While all infos can be found, the design could be a bit clearer to make it easier to understand. Alright, let's try the Balkan risotto from Track and Eat. Very nice, not too salty, but it's also not missing any salt. It's also nice that it's not too wet. It's, I think it's just right. It has nice spices. Uh, it's a good mix of rice and beef. You taste the uh, tomato in there. And otherwise it's a, uh, very, I think it's a very neutral taste, which I think is quite nice too, so it's not too overly spicy or too overly salty or anything in between that, like. All in all, I think the Balkan risotto from Track and Eat is a quite good tasting meal that is not overly dominating in any one direction which can be very positive if that's what you're looking for after a day of backpacking or climbing in the mountains. I'm now gonna finish this meal and enjoy the scenery here in Northern Norway. I hope that you enjoyed this episode of How Does It Taste and that you stay tuned for the next episode, which is coming soon. Bye.